I probably should have made this video a little bit earlier, maybe a couple of months ago, when some of you noticed that I was making more Apple content than I was Android content. And yes, before you ask, I was in LA at VidSummit meeting a whole bunch of other YouTubers. That's why my voice sounds like this. So let's just get past that for now. But the question is, why am I not doing more Android related hardware? It's not to say that I haven't been doing any. As a matter of fact, I've done some fairly recently. I might even links, leave some links in the description if you missed those. Um, and that's kind of the point. The fact that some of you didn't even know that I did is the problem. And one of the main reasons why I'm not doing a lot of Android content anymore, and I'm doing mostly Apple. It doesn't have so much to do with me liking Apple more than Android. It has something to do with you. And I'll tell you why. Right after this. this, this Players, welcome back, and for all you new people, welcome. My name is Travis, and I do tech videos every single week and have a blast doing them. Today, we're going to talk about why I've been doing more iPhone content than Android. So let's just get into the video. Some of you have watched my brand loyalty videos, and in some ways, that's kind of required viewing for you to understand my viewpoint of different brands and different technologies. So if you have not seen any of those videos, I'll leave a link in the description for the latest one. They all basically say the same thing, and that is don't pledge your loyalty to any one particular brand, which might seem at odds with the content that I've been putting out lately. I admit it's been very Apple focused. Obviously recently the iPhone 13 and the iPad mini came out. So of course I'm gonna focus on that. But the reality is I actually made this decision not very long ago and I struggled with it for quite a long time. Up until the iPhone 11 Pro Max came out, I was very much an Android user, used all the Samsung Galaxy Note phones ever since the Galaxy Note 2. And before that I was using Android phones as well, never really used an iPhone before. Once the 11 Pro Max came out and I tried it, I actually quite liked it. So I did a little bit more Apple content than I used to. I've always been about 50-50. Uh, and even before that I was doing things like headphone reviews and I don't do those either. Um, but it's not because I don't like them. Again, this all comes down to about the same thing, and that is you and views. Some of you may be surprised that I do videos so people will watch them. I know, right? I love when people leave a comment and say, oh, you only did this video because you want to get all the views. Yes, that's, that's how I make money, and that's how this channel keeps going. It's a little bit like saying the only reason you go to your job is to make money. I would expect you to say yes. So when content doesn't work as well, you don't feel motivated to do it. When I've been doing Android content lately, including the Amazon Renewed series of videos, they're not really performing as well as they used to back when I was more 50-50. Um, I don't know if it's because there's less interest in Samsung or whatever the case may be, but really the only content that's working right now is Apple. And while I would like to do things like headphones and speakers, the reality is that stuff doesn't really perform anymore on my, con on my channel anymore. And that's just the way YouTube works. It recommends to people the content that they like to watch. And most of you right now are liking the Apple content. So when I see comments saying that I should do more Android content and I realize they haven't watched any of the videos I've done recently about Android, that really kind of proves the point. If you're not watching it, I won't make it. And while some of you might think, well, you know, who cares how many views it gets? I do, because it's a little bit like if you went to your job and your boss said, look, you can work any Thursday you want to, but we're not going to pay you as much. And we're not going to appreciate that the fact that you came in and made less money or even care that you're there. That's what lower views are. Less money, less visibility and no growth. It's just not worth the time. So if I put out videos about specific things and they don't work, I tend to stop doing them. I know, surprise, right? I'm doing my job, crazy, crazy. So because the Apple content is doing so well, I'm doubling down on it. And the thing is, it's not even that I like Apple products more. I do enjoy them. I'm actually enjoying using an Apple ecosystem, so to speak. But the things like the Galaxy Z Fold 3 to this year was just absolutely amazing. And for me, the best 120 Hertz display I've used all year. I love it. I absolutely love it. I would love to have it. I would love to do a review on it and a whole bunch of videos, but they would go nowhere on this channel. And it just, just wouldn't make sense for me. As an up and coming creator, listen, you have to kind of focus on one or two things. You try to go much beyond outside of that umbrella, it's very hard to grow. And before you say anything about people like MKBHD, they have millions of, he has millions of subscribers. So there's not like, it's not the same thing. When you're an up and coming creator, YouTube kind of treats you a certain way. When you're putting out content to a specific type of person and that person engages with it, you get more views. If you haven't done a Samsung video in a while and YouTube puts it out to people who like to watch Apple, and they don't watch the Samsung content, it tends to go nowhere. So you get less views. So it kind of forces me to make a choice. Any good business would make this choice. They would 
cut the products that are not selling and sell more of the products that are. And that's basically what's happening here. The product that is selling are as the Apple content. And I do enjoy Apple. I do like Apple. I do absolutely miss some of the more innovative styles of Android. Now, it doesn't mean I'll never do Android products again. The Pixel 6 sounds really interesting to me. So I may peek over, try it, and even bring a video on the website, on the channel. And then, I, you know, I'm just going to have to know it's not going to perform well, which is demotivating, kind of upsetting, and just all around not fun. And if I'm not having fun making content, then there's really no point for me to make it. And for those of you that really enjoy my content, you would be losing out too. It really sucks that I have to make a decision like this. I'm kind of forced. My hand is forced. This is the way it works. Trust me when I tell you I've tried a bunch of different things to have you guys and gals watch more Android-based content. And while some of you have been very supportive, there's just not enough of you to be able to be sustainable. I just can't do it. Um, maybe if YouTube changes the way this works, um, then you know, I'll give it another shot at it. Or maybe I'll get to the point where I have enough people watching that if I do a video on an Android, it's not so bad that uh, it's kind of demotivating and it just doesn't really work. For the larger creators that do it, my hat's off. They're at a point where they can do that. That's great. But even for them, their things that are outside of their niche, so to speak, could underperform. But their underperforming videos are actually my overperforming videos. So it's kind of relative. At the end of the day, when something on the Android side of the fence happens that I think is interesting or cool, I'm going to try to cover it. I wish I could do it all the time. Matter of fact, I'd like to go 50-50. So some of you might be thinking, why don't you open up an Android only channel? And I'm considering it. I just don't know if enough of you that are still around watching my content would go over there. If I start over, I might be starting over for zero. And that might be okay. I have to really consider this. If it's something that you want to see me do, leave a comment below and let me know. Android only content, no Apple, and maybe this is the Apple channel. I don't know. Sounds like something that I could maybe consider. And at the end of the day, I actually want to do other things on YouTube, not just tech. I feel like I have a lot more in me to really entertain you guys and gals. You've only seen a very small slither of my personality. And let me tell you, there's a lot more there. So uh, I have a lot to think about and I hope this makes sense. I'm not not doing Android videos because I don't like it or that I think it's bad. It just doesn't perform. And that's kind of what it is. I'll see you next time. Peace and love.